Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Aaron Wright. And I'm Deborah Knapp. First at 10, Asians living in fear. They are being attacked. Leaders calling it a crisis. Tonight, a call for change to stop the hate. We have team coverage for you. We are following controversial comments from a San Antonio congressman. Some claim he made racist remarks during a hearing on anti-Asian violence. But first tonight, an apparent hate crime against a San Antonio restaurant. The Barrow County District Attorney is vowing justice will be served. Let's go live to Eyewitness News reporter Henry Ramos for how the DA plans to handle the case. Henry. District Attorney Joe Gonzalez says he will prosecute whoever vandalized Noodle Tree to the full extent of the law. He says if that person is caught, found guilty and charged with a hate crime, well, he promises severe punishment. This is not who San Antonio is. We will not tolerate this. Only way to drive out hate and the acts that it manifests is through love and compassion. Standing in solidarity, Bear County and San Antonio leaders say enough is enough. This is not about one restaurant and one restaurant owner being Asian. Noodle Tree was recently targeted with hateful messages. <laughs> Sunday, anti-Asian and anti-mask graffiti covered the Northwest Side business. My commitment to you is that we will be on it. As the hate crime investigation continues, the eatery got back to business Thursday for the first time since the attack. But they closed the dining room and offered pickup only. The owner says they're still getting threats. It makes me angry. It's a bigoted coward that would do something like that. Leaders say the racist remarks and attacks have no place here. These are the most American people I've ever come across because they stand for all the values that we hold dear, love, hard work, Worship. When somebody passes away, we always say, rest in peace. Can we work on live in peace? Henry, you asked Chief McManus for an update. Uh, Deborah, Chief McManus told me that. Uh, Deborah, Chief McManus told me they're not just treating this as a regular graffiti case. He says the detective assigned to this investigation is working nonstop every day. Meanwhile, as for the restaurant Noodle Tree, according to an online post from the owner, uh, they plan to open for dine-in tomorrow and that security will be there as well. We're live outside the Bear County Courthouse tonight. Henry Ramos, KINS 5, Eyewitness News.